Hello and welcome back everyone. I'm iPro Hobby and today I'm going to give you a little tour of my Animal Crossing Island. Um, so this is the island that I've had since like Animal Crossing came out. And yeah, so I got it pretty much when it came out and during lockdown my boyfriend got it for me. And I haven't played in a couple months so there might be a lot of weeds around but I just wanted to show you guys what I kind of have going on here. So this is my little house. Wait, I have some purple and white roses over here, and I got some weeds. I'm gonna have to pick all those up. I've got a little sitting area with a puzzle and the little pond and pumpkins. Halloween is my favorite holiday, hence why I have my little devil horns on with my little Halloween dress. I have a lantern with a little swing set. And before we go into the island, I will show you my home and what I have so far. I'm not gonna lie, it's not very good. Um, because I, I've just had so much trouble trying to find things. Oh no, I've got cockroaches. Like I said, it's been so long since I played. Um, but yeah, this is like my little living room. I got my little workbench in here and I love this. Uh, I can't think of the name of the table now. I watch so much anime and yeah, I still can't remember the name of this table, but it's the little warmer table with a blanket and I have my like one year island cake on it. My little stereo. I got a hamster over here and a turtle doggy. Um, and over here I got my fireplace. I've just got a bunch of random stuff up here, honestly. Oh, Pango. Oh, Pango's here to visit us. All right, what, okay. Pango, where are you? Okay, come on in. Hi, Pango. Oh, let's talk to her. This is totes amazing. I've never seen anyone maintain their intercom monitor so well. <laughs> My gadgets break super fast, but if I can't jazz up the insides with glitter, why even bother? Oh, she's so cute. I love her. But yeah, so that's this area. I Back here is my bedroom. Um, yeah, so one thing I've been thinking about doing for this is restarting my island for the channel and either doing videos or streaming it. So if you have any ideas about that, let me know in the comments down below so that we can decide where to go from there. And this is my bedroom right now. So I have my bed. I have the giant panda bear because I absolutely love him. And I have my little record player and my Switch and dresser, mirror, all that fun stuff. I love the gumball machine because when I was a kid, I had a gumball machine in my bedroom. And um, my stepdad would either buy me gumballs for it or like M&Ms and stuff to keep in there. Oh, I don't want to be like a time vampire for you. I should probably head home snoof. Okay, I guess see you. I love you, Pango. Okay, yes, 100% Pango. We'll have to get together. All right. And over here, I have my bathroom. Bathroom. It's not really much of a bathroom right now. I do have a toilet, and this is the closest thing to a tub I have, but I kind of like it. I mean, I'd love one of those in my own home. I have a little shower, and I put a little kitty litter box in here and the ironing board. I do have a sink and a vanity. I put some incense in here to keep it smelling nice, and it's just kind of nice to have, like, incense or a candle when you're taking a bath, you know, and some, get some beauty products here and some towels, and I put the little fishies on the wall. I felt it fit the bathroom. Um, okay, and then I have my kitchen. My kitchen is the worst part right now because I have not... Get over here, cockroach. Okay, I'll watch my words. Um, but yeah, because I've been wanting... There's a specific set that I've been wanting. Um, I can't think of the name of it now because it's been so long since I played this. But it's got like the little kitchenette and it's got like a sink and stuff on it. And I have tried for so long to get the crafting recipes for it, but I've never been able to find it. So the best I have right now is a sink, a fridge, I got the knives and like the dishes up there. I have this little island thing, the stove and sink in it, but the rest of the stuff is just like random kitchen stuff that I'd like to have in here when I have the rest of it. But yeah, so I have the espresso machine, stand mixer, rice cooker, all that stuff. <laughs> and I have a cute wallpaper, but the rest of the stuff is just kind of thrown together in here. So please don't judge me. We've all been there. And I know my island's not like as beautiful and perfect as like some people's on here, but that's just me. I don't even have the final like upgrade to my house with the basement. Um, 
my upstairs though is like a little music room area in science. So I have all my DJ, my speakers and drums and saxophone, guitar, and this other record player, and then my little chemistry set over here. So yeah, that's my house. And now we can go take a little tour and walk around the island. And while we wait, we have little Leaf back here, our puppy. She's just snoozing right now, taking a little nappy. But yeah, I'd love to see your guys' islands too. So if you have like island videos, just link them please in the comments. I'm not gonna pick up weeds as we do this. So if we leave my house, we go to the left here. We have a little playground. And moving on up, hi Pango. Oh, little traveling guys here. This is like a little market space I made, like a kind of like reminiscent of a far farmer's market. Um, looks cranny, of course. And if we keep going around a circle, we'll go to branch to the branched off part soon. And our little town hall area, and our spook bill flag. That's the name of my island. We keep going down this path. I got this little picnic area over here. I think it's really cute. And then if we come on, follow the path some more. Down here we have more houses. And I kind of tried to decorate them based on each villager. So we have, I can't remember all my villagers' names now. I'm terrible. Here, hold on. Let's go up here. Uh, oh yeah, this spare dude's house. So I gave him some flowers and like a little bird bath. And this is, um, give me, this is Sheldon's house, he's a jock, so I gave him a little barbell. And over here, oh I can't get to it. I can't remember whose house this is, but yeah, another house. This is my campsite, I kind of decorated my campsite a little bit with some tulips, I put a little workbench here and a little clothes drying rack and a lantern. And then we have our museum. I put my T-Rex out here. I made this little area that looked kind of like an excavation area. I thought it was cute. I think I saw the idea on a Pinterest board or something. And this is part of my beach. So here I have some little loungers with some tiki torches. And up here, I put a couple of rocking chairs with some books and a little table so you can just sit out by the sea and read some books. It sounds like something I would like to do, so that's why I added that in. And if we move on up here past our market, we have a little bamboo forest and then my orchard. And so I planted all my different trees and I made little, um, signs for them so you know what's in each row and up here I have my flower gardens where I do my hybrid flowers and if I come over here I don't have most of this stuff developed over here right now Oops, I gotta remember how to do everything excuse me oh no 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 keep playing I'm feeling really dumb right now Oh, no, that's reactions. Here we go. Okay. I want my ladder. So if we go up here. I made like a little infinity pool type thing over here where it goes over the edge. I thought that was really cute. And... Yeah, see, like most of this I don't really have developed right now. So... There's all that, and then my little beach area is back here. I haven't decorated that or anything though. So let's go back up here. And I've got this little waterfall. And just more flowers. Um, let me get out my pole real quick. There we go. Let's go across here. And then we can climb down over by Clay's house. Alright. And I can show you what I have for my beach and stuff over here too. Over here I put a lighthouse. I thought it was cute. I don't, once I have a lighthouse I really want to use it. And this is Clay's house. 
He just was, has some of the basic decorations that he needed for building his house. And then if we come down here, we have the Abel sisters. And let's see. Um, this, we have Pango's house. I gave her a little chair table. And over here, we have Diana's house. And then we have Daisy's house. I think that's most of what I have over here. Oh, I'll have to check you out later. And down here, I have a little beach area too. The little boat, the sand castle, some more lounge chairs, water cooler, surfboard, all that fun stuff. We can cross this bridge and this takes us back over to our other row of houses. And then if we go back this way where we started and cross this bridge, we will find Bree's house. So this is Bree's house. And then I have this cute little sitting area over here with all the wicker furniture. It's like one of my favorite parts. And I have a year-round pumpkin patch because <laughs> I love pumpkins. Um, I think there's one other area I can show you guys. So if we cross this bridge, this is my big waterfall. I'm very happy with this and very proud of it. And I think that's pretty much it for my island. Like I said, like I've had this game for almost two years now, but I didn't go as hardcore into it as everyone else did. And so my island's not as well put together, but I still like it and think it's cute. So anyways, that's it. And so let me know what you guys think of my island down in the comments below. And if you think it would be fun for us to start a new Animal Crossing island together, let me know that as well, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy this video and enjoy hearing me talk all the time. But yeah, that's it for today, and I will talk to you all next time. Bye!